Hi viewer, I welcome you to Dream TV. It is the station where you watch and learn. I'll be taking you through business studies for one. Uh, lesson number 16, the topic it is production. I'm your tutor, Dosin Mudun. Welcome. Uh, today's lesson objective, we are going to discuss factors of production and the ones of each. Uh, in our previous lesson, we managed to talk about these uh, factors of production where we said they are four in number. Number one, it is the lad. We talked about the lad where we said that it is the natural settings. We also said that it wages, um, it's whatever it gets, it returns are, are the, the rent that is what it gets or the rewards it is the rent or even royalty it can be royal number two we also discussed about the labor where we said that the labor that is supposed to be paid it is the one that we refer to it as the labor and it a uh, payment it is the salaries or the wages now, we want to look at the third one, which is the capital, and the fourth one, which is the entrepreneurship. Now, when we talk about the capital, capital, it refers to those goods that are produced, not direct, not for direct consumption, but to be used in production, producing other goods and services. So, I've produced a commodity, that is supposed to be used to produce other commodities, that is what is capital. For example, we have the portion meal. Portion meal has been made and have bought it. That is a capital. Photocopies. That is capital. It refers to all man-made resources used in production of goods and services. Everything. If I thought it is a laptop, that is an, a capital. If I thought it is a computer, a capital. All the machineries in the factory, that is capital. Capital includes machines, tools, and equipment. These items are also referred to as capital goods or cap producer goods. Capital earns rewards in form of interest. So whatever it gets, it is interest. What are the characteristics? It is a basic factor of production. Without the capital, you cannot produce. Without the portion meal, you cannot make mirror the, the maize cannot get the maize from without the, the fractional distillation column you cannot uh, process the crude oil it is money made another characteristics it is money made number three it is subject to depreciation so all the machineries they depreciate every time, every time, every time. They keep on depreciating. Number four, it can be improved through technology. Then we look at the next, which is the entrepreneurship. Entrepreneurship is the ability to organize other factors of production in appropriate uh, proportions for effective production so when you are now organizing the other production factors organizing the capitals putting land labor you're putting it in place and now you're in order for you to get the production that is what we refer to it as the entrepreneurship the reward for the entrepreneurship is profit functions Start the business. So you're the one to start the business. Take that risk, start the business. Control the business. You control the, the operation of the business. Makes decisions. You make the decision. 
you give what you expect. Bears all the risk and enjoys the profit. Then acquires and pays for the other factors. So you reward the other factors. Uh, activity. These four functions of entrepreneurship as a factor of production. State four roles of entrepreneurs in production. If at all you want to get the ref refer, you can refer from the KLB 2011 Inventor Secondary Business Student Book 1, that edition. If at all you have any question, any additional material, you can just get us through the SMS. You can also get us from the YouTube. You can get us from the Facebook and through the Twitter. Stay tuned to your TV. Thank you.